quickly ask, yeah. how, how tough a decision was it for you to finally pull the pin and, and, and what ultimately drove it? No, it was hard, but it was, it was really hard because obviously as everyone in the room knows, rugby's our life. But, um, but if I'm honest, I was told mid-year and um, I found that hard mid-year and I didn't accept it mid-year. And then when I got back on the field after I'd sort of recovered from the infection, I knew in my last eight, eight games left I was playing, I knew that I had no longevity in the game. I couldn't lift my left arm above 90 degrees, I had no strength in it, couldn't do any weights. And I just kept falling further and further away from the speed of the game. So by by, by it came to the time to make the decision, it was the right decision, and I'd made peace with it. So and, and you know I've not looked back since. Sure, I'm going to miss it. I miss it. I do miss it. I miss the competing, I uh, miss the camaraderie. But I've, I do have a slow release of that as well because I'm still around the team two or three days a week, maybe you know four or five times a week. I'll be at the game day, so I'll still get I'll still get my fix, uh, but just not the, the the contact, the impacts that that. I've loved over my career.